So here's another edition of Sports Blab. Uh, I got to give my public service announcement, of course. So wear a mask, wash your hands, socially di social distance. That's how you do it. Six feet away. Ready? Let's talk sports. This is Isaiah. Nice. I'm Tim. This is Isaiah. Nice to meet you guys. I see you're a big Viking fan, yes, right? Yes, I am. So talk about the Vikings. How are they going to do this year? They're going to do really good this year. Like, what are they going to do? They have a new cool, they have a new wide receiver. Who? Jeff, uh, Jeff, Jefferson. Yep. And is he going to replace Stephon Diggs? Yes, he is. Is he going to do better than Stephon Diggs? Yes. Who's going to win the North Division? Vikings, Vikings Bears, Packers. Vikings, definitely Vikings. Lions, maybe the Lions come back. What do you think of the... Uh, Packers drafting a quarterback when they got Aaron Rodgers. Well, Aaron Rodgers old, and Aaron Rodgers. We don't know how Aaron Rodgers is going to play. Does he have the last tank in there? Oh, does he have anything left in the in the tank? Is what you're saying? Yes. Yeah. Are you a chess player at all? Somewhat. Of, somewhat of. There you go. Uh, uh, you play tennis? Yes. No, I do not. Were you my my ping pong coach at the tournament? Yes, and he did do really and good. How did guys. I do? He did terrible. He would come up there in the middle of a match and say, "You got to do better. You got to do this. You got to do this." I want to make him look it's like right. you're poo, supposed poo, to support poo. me. I want to support him. But so they have the Viking offensive line. They're going to protect Kirk Cousins. Did you like the, the Vikings extending Kirk Cousins' contract? Yes, and I like that they draft a good guy to hold for Kirk Cousins. The offensive line. Yes. Yeah. They, and you know what I liked about the offensive line? Big, beefy guys. Both yeah, big, like beef. They get six, them buffed, seven, they get them buffed. 310 and get them. pounds. I'm tired of drafting small guys. I want big guys. I want big guys, cousins. strong guys that can <clears throat> move people and protect people. Look at Tom Brady gets enough time. Oh, yeah. Speaking of which, tell me about Tom Brady and Tampa Bay. He went to Bay. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. So is Rob Podolsky. Is that going to make a difference to Tampa Bay? Good it's going to make them more move. of a threat. Ooh, like, explain. They got. Do you think Tom Brady still has it in the tank, or is he over the hill? I think he's old. I think he's old. No, he's older, yes, but does he still have talent? Sort of. No. <clears throat> Why do you say that? <coughs> because he's 42. 42. 42, guys. 42. And if he gets set, then could he be injured or paralyzed? Do you think he, the fact that he did... Not so great in New England last year due to his drop in talent or the people around him. The, I think the linemen didn't drop enough for him, and I think he gave up. I think it was time for him. He's to, not a, he's not a scrambler. My personal take is they no, had no offensive line. You didn't have Gronkowski. You had Edelman, yeah. but no other really receivers. Sanu is a slot receiver. They need yeah, deep Antonio threat. Brown tells you that in trouble. You know, it's like if you're always running for your life, how do you succeed? So I don't how do you think, succeed? I know a lot of pundits will say it's, well, he's this age, and based on stats, he you know, dropped and this and that, should have done that. He's going, going downhill. It's not what he used to be, is what they say. I say... We'll find out in Tampa Bay because they got a great offensive line. Yes, they do. They got dynamite receivers, dynamite top, uh, tight ends on top of how Rob Gronkowski's coming back. He's and they got a great running back. So they have a good offensive machine. And they have a good and kicker. We'll see. I believe, and they have a good kicker. Yeah, and I believe he'll do well. I believe I can he'll see, do well. I just see Tampa Bay. He's still got it. In other words, he's still got it in my eyes. Tampa Bay is going to support and bite me. That's it's my... so like ping pong. You'll disagree. I still got it. I still got it. Even for a guy that's still chilly, he still got it. Hey, uh, you like biking, right, Isaiah? Yes, I do. And where do you like to bike? I biking around the neighborhood, walk biking with my friend. No, it's my friend Tim right here. We remember we we took a selfie the other day of Professor Donald Isaiah and myself. Remember I talked earlier on another sports lab, but. But biking down by the Minnesota River and Fort Snelling by the old Cedar Avenue Bridge. Well, <clears throat> yesterday, us three, we went to Bush Lake, went around part of Bush Lake and then the Highland Park Reserve in Bloomington, Minnesota. Was that fun or what? Yes, it was fun. Good exercise. Gets you good cardio. And we had no rain. No rain. And we pushed it. And we even went on some one little nasty hill. I thought there'd be no hills on this route, but there was one little nasty hill. But we got nature. Nature. We got back to nature. In fact, I'm thinking of calling you Nature Boy. Woo! 
I call him Tom Sawyer anyways because he'll hike anywhere, everywhere. I love that Mountain name. bike trails, flat trails, lakes, rivers, streams, anybody, uphill, downhill, anybody you name it, you'll do it. You can, you can like with a comment. You can talk about my nickname. Yeah. I love the nickname. You guys love it? Yep. Comment. Yep, Nature Boy. Woo. I call him Tom Sawyer because he goes everywhere. Huck Ben Tom Sawyer. All right, well, I think I like to keep these episodes short. So uh, anything else to say about the world of sports? Did I give you a way to see this year? This is their year? And my friend Tim's going to lose weight. Yeah, I'm going to lose weight because I bike so much with Isaiah and Professor Donald. Yeah, all right. That's not some bad sign, is it? No. Yeah, it is. No, it's not. Let me see that. Okay, that's okay. Okay, that's a good sign. It's not a bad sign. All right, that's it for Sports Plan.